the scanning technique for the pancreas in lateral recumbent canine patients. In this ultrasound, the following technical aspects are recommended. A linear transducer with three to four centimeter depth will provide the best image. Utilize high frequencies with or without harmonics. The general gain should be maintained at approximately 60 to 65%. Select the third or fourth TGC curve from the drop-down menu. Place the patient in left lateral recumbency so its limbs are directed towards the sonographer. This will allow one person to have control over the patient's front and hind limbs. The right limb of the pancreas is best visualized in the transverse plane, using the duodenum as a landmark. The pancreas is located in the mesenteric border of the duodenum. During transverse scans, ensure the transducer marker is always pointed to the right side of the patient. To ensure you are in the right location, locate the transverse view of the right kidney so that the superficial duodenum is visualized. Typically, the colon will appear medial to the short axis view of the duodenum. The pancreas has a somewhat triangular shape on the mesenteric border of the duodenum. If Doppler is used, the pancreatic duodenal vein can be seen as round and anechoic in the center of the pancreas. It is important to obtain real-time videos of the previously described landmarks such as the duodenum and portal vein near the hilus of the liver. These videos will help the radiologist assess the right limb and body of the pancreas.